shit. Okay. Oh, this thingy came off. <laughs> Not sure where it goes. I think it goes there. Okay. So I've been trying to think of small gifts that I can give to like colleagues and colleagues. This makes me sound so professional. Oh, I'm Maggie. Grab me with a hammer. So I've been trying, I've been working on little gifts and stuff that I can give to colleagues and associates, you know, staff at work and stuff. Nice little homemade gifts. So I saw, maybe they go like the Cracker Barrel where you go and they have like those table games. I saw this cute thing on um, Pinterest and it was like a tic-tac-toe board and it had like dowels. I thought that's cool. So I'm going to take some scrap hardwood I have and cut up in squares. And then we can like cut holes and paint and you know what I mean. So that's what I'm going to do now. I'm going to get on the miter saw and cut me up some squares. So I'm going to cut up a few squares. Okay, so we got the squares all cut. On to the next step. So you can barely see me, but I wanted you to see the boards. So I've got two different sizes. I got this little size and this bigger size, and we're going to make tic-tac-toes on them. And I already picked out which size dowels. So I'm going to use this size dowel, which I don't know what size dowel that is. It's the medium size, whatever that is. And then the bigger dowels I'm going to put here. So, but to do that, I got to make our squares. So I'm just going to take a pencil Okay, so then we got these, they're pencil lined in. I'm gonna go over to the drill press and drill the holes on all of these. So let's go to the drill press. Okay, so we're at the drill press. I got the bit for the larger dowels. I'm gonna try to make <laughs> like holes line up as best as I can. We can do this, I know we can, I have faith in me. I'm going to try to stop on that blue tape. I'm trying to make it in the center of each square. Give it back. Okay. Okay. Here we go. There's one. I'm going to make eight more. Okay, so that's the first one. That's the first one. I did it to fit these dowels. So, see that? And then what I'll do is I'll make these dowels two different colors. I don't know what colors yet. We haven't gotten that far. But what I'll do next is I'll sand this all down and make this all nice and smooth and sand down the edges and everything. You won't see the pencil line. But what I'm going to do right now off camera is I'm going to put the holes in the rest of the boards. So I'll be back when I'm done with that. Okay, I'm back. So we've got our four squares for the holes. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to sand them all nice and clean and smooth up the edges and stuff and make it look like legit things. And then I was going to take my Dremel tool and sand in there. So that's my 
Next things I'm gonna be doing. Hi. Yep, I know. I'm outside, I'm like the driveway. Again, it's to keep the sawdust down. Because happy wife, happy life. So my thought is, okay, there we go. Okay, so I'm gonna take my Dremel tool and sand the little holes. That's what I'm thinking. Is to use electricity. Electric you don't use electricity if we can help it. So this is solar charged. Okay. Okay. Got them done. Can you see? Oh, you can't even see me. Hi, I'm here. Okay, can you see the wood? This wood here? Can you see it? Yeah, you can see it. Okay, we're gonna use this on it for no other reason than because that's what I got. Okay, so the last steps with our tic-tac-toe boards was painting the dowels. So the bigger ones I did silver and black. And the smaller ones I did gold and white. And see, they fit so cute in here. Can you see that okay? Now, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put a picture up here. I can't remember which side it goes on. But anyways, I took these this last weekend to North Carolina to see the grandbabies. And my granddaughter, instead of playing tic-tac-toe, like to play, she called it bimbo. And now I can never unforget that bimbo. And she just tried to see which one of us, because I brought two boards, which one of us could fill it up with the dowels first. So she, one would be gold and one would be white and whoever is fastest. Of course, she was always the fastest. So, bimbo, if you don't want to play tic-tac-toe. So I just have to get this one ready now with the lines on this one. This. I kind of want to write, see, I should have brought these down further. because I should that way I could have written tic-tac-toe up there the next ones I make this is a good experiment though thank you so I'm gonna keep doing this um thank you all for watching I'm really enjoying doing recycled, repurposed Christmas gifts this year. So, you know, the electricity for the tools is coming from the solar panels. The wood has been scrap woods and pallet wood, which by the way, I just got some more pallets. Um, so, so far it's taking more time but it kind of feels kind of cool to be able to say it's from recycled wood. So thank you for watching. And I hope you try to make your own bimbo or tic-tac-toe boards. Happy holidays.